that's good for kids, you know? We all grew up better off because we saw some cr- crazy stuff in our movies growing up. Zachary, if I told you 20 years ago that you'd be in a row with Helen Mirren, would you believe me? As a matter of fact, yes, because I have had words for this woman for 20 years. I can't believe the things that she, you know, are you kidding me, man? Like what a crazy, amazing fever dream of the best level. Like how, and with, and Lucy Liu and Rachel Zegler, who the three of them are this trifecta of awesomeness that are so good playing their roles that are also different and also, also so kick-ass and powerful and beautiful and talented on screen and off. Um, you know, it's crazy, but yes, I mean, Helen Mirren, she's a dame. I've worked with a dame now. I mean, dame. <laughs> uh, when I watched this movie the other day, I like, I was on my own in the cinema, got the popcorn, got the drink. And I just sat there and I was like, I have a cousin who's eight and 12. I'm telling you, it's going to blow their mind. Did, have you watched that through anyone else's eyes yet to see them watching it? The new movie? Yeah. I have not. I've only, I, I have seen, I've seen it one time. It wasn't fully finished. It was almost, almost finished. Uh, and it was uh, with my agents. That's the only time I've seen the movie. I can't wait to watch it with my nephews. I can't wait to watch it. Well, uh, really anybody. I mean, you know, it's, it's, it's like, I, I really feel like we were able to strike a really cool chord with the first one and made a really good movie. And objectively, we made an even better version this time around, you know, which is saying something. I mean, I, I know I'm biased. I mean, I'm the titular character of this franchise, but I think it's really special. And I think part of what makes it special is that it really harkens back to that feeling that we all got growing up in the 80s and 90s of like Amblin, Lucasfilm type of movies. There are things where it's it's suitable for all ages, but it's, you know, you're, you're like top of G into PG-13. So it's not for the littlest of kids necessarily, because there's a little bit of like, ooh, there's some darkness, there's some spookiness, there's some creepiness to it, but that's good for kids, you know? We all grow up better off because we saw some cr- crazy stuff in our movies growing up. You uh, coming to jumping out of the screen is that you're all, all friends. Like, is oh. that true to say that you guys all, like, do, do you go out with each other? Is there like a staff night out beforehand? We are like, right, this is movie two. We've got a few more lads coming in, get to know each other. I mean, essentially, yeah, I, you know, for this one, I mean, I, I was able to rent a, a really cool place. We shot it in Atlanta and I had a place that had a pool and a yard and barbecue. And so I would facilitate as many gatherings as I could. It's just, I love doing it anyway. I just love community and people and bringing people together. Um, and I'd like to make sure that people feel loved and appreciated and and that they have a place at the table, you know, and and connecting all these, our, our original Shazamly with our new uh, goddesses that were coming in who were so wonderful. And everyone just clicked so well, you know. Um, but for us as the Shazamly, it was great because we all got to do it once before, albeit briefly. You know, all, you, all the supers only came in at the end of the first movie. But now we all got to just go run with that and have fun with that. And um, and everybody was was game. Everybody wanted to roll up their sleeves and go jump in the sandbox and have fun. Is there a moment when you've got the suit on to yourself and you're going, oh, I'm a superhero? <laughs> oh, yeah often you know what i mean like there's plenty of times where i'm just there and i'm being me and i'm in my head and i'm doing whatever it is doing life <laughs> but then you know you're just kind of looking around waiting for the next shot and you're like what is my life what is this i'm standing in a closed off road in the, in the downtown atlanta we we have blocked off an entire street we're blowing up cars in the middle of downtown atlanta blowing them in the air i'm pretending that i'm fighting a, a dragon that Lucy Liu is riding atop while I am donning spandex. And that's not, that's not normal. That's not normal. <laughs> and it should never be normal. It should always catch you by surprise and be like, holy crap, this is amazing. Have you got to keep one of them? Like surely there's more than one suit. Has no. There- oh, no, 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 no. I don't need to keep the suit. I, I'm not going to wear that thing a day more than I have to. Uh, it's very difficult to go to the bathroom in that thing. And I mean, not that it's not fun. I do want to get one. I'd like to get one that's like an easy on, easy off that I can go hit children's hospitals and stuff. <laughs> oh, that'd be lovely. But, but, I, but the real thing is a whole thing. <laughs> <laughs> Daddy, look, my time is up, Zachary. Thanks so much. The movie was so heartwarming. It was so lovely. Cheers. Thank you, brother. I really appreciate that. I appreciate you. Have a lovely day. Cheers.